Hi, I'm Greg Priest with Priest Tools. I have four new, very cool accessories for the Precision Matthews PM728 mill. The quill stop, the spindle brake, the power lift, and the power drawbar. The first accessory is the quill stop. The quill stop is used for controlling depth of cut for boring and chamfering operations. It's a bolt-on accessory, which means there are no modifications required to your mill. The quill stop consists of the speed nut, which is a precision graduated speed nut, the half 20 threaded UNF rod, the stop plate, and the quill plate. To use the quill stop, you use the speed nut to set your depth of cut and dial it into the appropriate depth. Then you lower the quill and the nut stops on the stop plate. The next accessory is the, the spindle brake. The spindle brake is used for locking the spindle for doing tool changes, which allows you the use of both hands to do the tool change. The way it works is that you release the spring plunger and the lock plate goes back against the spindle. You rotate the spindle until the flat on the spindle meshes with the lock plate. Once this is done, the spindle's locked and you can use one hand to turn the drawbar and the other hand to remove and insert the new tool. Once the tool change is complete, then you bring the lock plate forward and it locks into place in the open position. When you activate the spindle brake, a safety switch locks out power to the mill so that the spindle will not turn. The power lift motorizes the lifting and lowering of the headstock. The power lift is a bolt-on accessory. It does not require modification of your mill. The power lift consists of the operator switch, the enclosure, a high torque DC motor and power supply, and the hardware necessary to connect to the Z-axis lead screw. And to operate the power lift, you simply push up or down. That sound is the sound of your shoulder and arm not turning the hand wheel. This is the Priest Tools Power Drawbar. It's a pneumatic system that uses compressed air from 90 to 120 PSI. The Power Drawbar is a bolt-on accessory. There are no modifications required to your mill. The Power Drawbar consists of the cylinder, the cylinder plate, the mounting plate, there's also a mounting plate back here for the pneumatic valve, your electrical control box, and then an R8 collet for use with quick change tooling. Operate the power drawbar, release the spring plunger and slide it into the activated position, which enables the activation switch, which activates the power drawbar and releases the tool. When you're done changing tools, you simply flip the switch and release the activation plate.